just come to live at our house? It's, it's a child. Today, a child was delivered at this address. So, well, I, I, um, I've been after this, this animatronic baby since I saw him or her. So now I'm going to make him, make it to him or her yet. At uh, Toy Fair in February. And finally, the little cutie here. Okay. Nicely detailed. Now, um, what I'm going to do, folks, is we're going to get him or her out of the box and have a look at uh, he, 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 her, he, her, and um, we are going to see what this youngster looks like underneath this clothing because I haven't seen anybody do that on YouTube and I want to try some attire and I'm not sure how I'm going to be able to dress this baby but I think it's going to be difficult and also I've got to make this little one feel welcome I've got the Wookiee twins and um, so later on in the video little one's going to meet the Wookiee twins and uh, got a couple of pogs as well just to make little one feel at home and finally we've got um kip kip yeah kip of course kip we've got kip here why is kip here um because i wanted to see i think oh oh i've got to wait kip up there yeah because um i have a feeling that kip and the new baby are a similar size. Oh, yeah. <laughs> She's delighted. Which is good because we we made well Paul made a cradle for Kip. I'm not even going to try and unpackage You're that to do it, then. because uh, I've had so so many disasters lately, folks. That uh, there's just no point. You know, just give it to Paul straight away. Methinks, methinks there are some bits of plastic, some bits of sellotape. Might as well uh, wake these folks up while we're waiting. Alright, Etta, we've got a new little family member. She says, I know. Oh, that was quickly done. What, 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 show the folks what's on the back. Oh, can't see anything there. Oh, Etta's excited. I wake Yorkie up as well. towards happening at the moment. I have a feeling that it will do once um it's come with some sort of um is it like a not Star Wars fan so uh some sort of charm or bracelet. Oh yeah we'll have a look at that later. Look at these two they're beside themselves look oh. look at this look how happy they are so mm -hmm. So what I'm going to do before anything else is I'm going to see what this little one looks like underneath this coat. So could you please pass the scissors, Paul? Yeah. Thank you. Because I have seen some unboxings, but I'm not so seeing anybody show what this little one looks like. Ah, oh, so this just simply comes off in the dark room. I think so. Some hot dinners, little thin arms. 
Hmm. It's not going to come up that way. I think. Do you think we'll have to take it off this way? Sure. But I think that's going to do it, folks, because the front doesn't open. So let's see. Pulling down. Yeah. Goodness. That's a tight fit, little one. I'm going to have to cut this. See, I'm not actually seeing anybody take one of these off. I don't suppose it's meant to come off, really, is it? Uh, I saw somewhere it said I'd removable. Like yes, I would like you to have a try. Don't worry, little one, we'll get you out of that old coat into some nice, comfy clothing. <laughs> Is it an old coat? <laughs> it looks like an old coat. Looks like an old bag. <laughs> oh, oh, is Paul, Paul going to do it? Is Paul going to do it? Oh, it's, it's looking like it. It's looking like it. There we go. Way! He's done it. He's got some sort of vest. Plastic vest. Okay, vests. so folks, just ignore that, Paul. Mm -hmm. So folks, as you can see, underneath that Lynn's coat, he's got, he's got a, 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 or he or she, he's got like a long vest. It's sort of plastic mould. And it's plastic moulded. <laughs> and that's where little Lynn's speaker is. So, uh, if you look at the back, we've got on, try me, and off. So we want to put this onto on. Mm -hmm. It's a bit of a clunky switch. I think that's on. Well, let's see if we. Ooh, do we have anything? Any different reaction? Yes, making baby noises now. Because little and little and hasn't really got legs and it's all flat here, uh -huh. so I think I'm going to have to make little and a girl uh -huh. so that I can put dresses on. Dresses or capes. Because that's all you know. All all that she can have is a dress or a cardigan. Uh -huh. So I'm going to try some cardigans. Now that looks like that's going to be huge, and this that's the smallest one I've got. But we'll try it anyway, won't we, Etta? Etta's a fashion queen. <laughs> oh, careful, little one. Let's see what... Let's see what... Uh, I got the kip, yes. Oh, shut up, Toby. Oh, that's better, better than that old cape, isn't it? <laughs> what do you think of the cozy card? <laughs> <laughs> oh my goodness, that is pretty cute. That is pretty cute. So that was the smallest cardigan I had. Right. Okay, well, I'm going over just the details of this baby. Do you want to go and let Poop. the tubes in? Actually, we've nearly finished because I can't believe it's eight minutes. It's, it's uh, nearly ten minutes. So, I'm going to have to do a, a part. Oh, 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 the cuteness! He's so cute! I'm going to have to do a part two. Hello, Toby. Look, new family member. <laughs> so I'll have to go now folks but um, we'll get little one to meet these friends in the next video and try some more clothes